it going everyone? This is Lucha 5 and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be looking at a Beedrill deck and this is the um, Beedrill from Evolutions. Um, very fun deck to play, very fun for taking out shamans, let me just tell you that. Um, and yeah, I will. tomorrow is Christmas Eve and the next day is Christmas Day, so I definitely won't be posting those days, that's quite obvious, but um... I will be back after that. So, let's get right into this match. Well, we lose the coin flip. Ooh, hey. They let us go first. That's nice. But, wow! We start with Shaman. Oh, that's just so nice. I love starting with Shaman. No, I really don't. I really don't. But, let's see what they have here. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Well, hopefully we can get a Sycamore with one of our trainer's mails or something. Uh... Okay, so we are playing Water Box, but what, you, what is nice is we do have the type advantage, which is super cool. Um, we'll grab a Forest of Giant Plants here. Ah, uh, play that down. Please let us have a Draw Supporter. Okay, there's Sycamore. There is a Sycamore. However, we do have to discard some stuff, but why not? We're gonna um throw that bursting balloon down. And this is this is actually my second recording because the first time the audio was all funky. Like it sounded like it was in a dank meme compilation or something. I don't know what that was about, but okay. What do we have here. What do we have that. Yep. We're gonna grab a crushing hammer we're using maybe next turn or something hmm I will so I'll get ultra ball here and what I might do yeah I'm gonna do this I'm just gonna discard Lysander and crushing hammer and grab a Kakuna Matata and then we're gonna evolve here Turn that down for you a bit, and yeah, we're just gonna pass the turn. Um, so he attaches the water energy. I'm kind of wondering why he chose to go second. Maybe it was a misclick. I did that all the time. Oh, hey, that's a smart play. He is going to Aqua Turbo. Seems like yeah. once he plays Giovanni Scheme. Okay, he chooses not to attack. I'm fine with that. You know what? We have more time to set up. Which I like. That was good. And let's start making some plays here. So, what do I want to grab? I could grab another Weedle, but I'm going to grab Kakuna. So, at least we can get started on another chain. Here. And let's just pass the turn. Simple turn. I really hope my audio doesn't get all messed up again. Because that's what happened in the last video. And it was towards the end. But, well, we'll see what happens. And it looks like we are playing against um, Water Toolbox. Which is, whew, that's a fun deck. Uh, we need to look out for that thing. Dacalaceon. That is... Not school. I mean, not, excuse me. Not cool. Not, not school. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I'm on winter break. So, he is heavy on the max elixirs right now, which I love max elixirs. And he hits us with the M, which is very and nice. Didn't get what I did there? Oh, okay. I'll stop. Mm -hmm. He got rid of our Force of Giant Plants, so that doesn't really matter, because we have another one in our hand. Put in that trainer's mail. See what he, let's see what he gets, let's see what he gets. Another in. He can't play it this turn, but, um, So 
Oh, he is going heavy duty on that Palkia. And, okay. He hits us for 50. We might just sacrifice our Shaman. But that Pearl Hurricane is a great attack. I made a deck out of this and played it at Pokemon League, and it did quite well. So, okay, we, we have some options here. We do have some options here. And I think I know what I'm going to do. So first, I'm just going to go like this. We're going to get a little Weedle. He's like, hey, kids. Throw him down the bench. Um, let's play Crushing Hammer here. Nice. We get to knock off an energy. Let's go with this energy. Not a bad play. We'll play this Revitalizer. Get this Kakuna back in our hand. Oh, oh yeah. We got to play this stadium. again. Whew, I panicked there. I panicked there. I did panic there. But we can... We can evolve now and get a perfect Sycamore. That's nice. But we gotta be careful not to deck out here. Well, that's super spicy and icy. Super spicy, nicey, icy. So we got, we can, we're hitting for 120 with Swarming Sting. Um, so, whew. we are in actually a very good position. We can knock out this Palkia. Oh, okay, he switches into Glaceon, EX. Mm, that's a bit of a problem. And he hits us with that N. Okay, not bad, not bad. Not bad. He's going to knock us out, though. Wait, we can Lysander, can't we? Yes, we can. The thing is, you know, I could... You can't, I could hit this for some damage, I could smack it, but it doesn't apply weakness and resistance for bench Pokemon, so here I'm just going to Lysander. I'm going to bring out that big ol' Palkia EX, and we're just going to take it out with a Swarming Sting. Bam. 240 damage. K.O. Alright, we got a Kakuna and another Ultra Ball. So I'm thinking of getting, you know, a Weedle with the Ultra Ball. Sounds so weird. And you know what, Glaceon? I don't care. I'm going to snipe the Manaphy. And I'll deal with you. So we swing Silent Lab. Um, I, I don't, ooh, this Glaceon's going to be annoying to get around. Because I believe if we put it on the bench and then attach it, um, well, like, it, its effects will wear off even if he used Crystal Ray. Oh, there we go. Hitting me with the Crystal Ray. Um, what do we, ooh, a Bursting Balloon. That's gonna be nice. What do we have in here? Can't use Revitalizer for anything, but, um, definitely not gonna be needing Sycamore this game. We don't want to deck out. Really? We just have a Beedrill? All we have? What's our deck? Okay, we got Forest of Giant Plants. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna grab it. I am going to grab it. Attach this here, and I'm gonna. I'm going to end. Well, I guess I won't really do anything. I was gonna say I was gonna try to not deck out, but it won't really do anything. We do have a Crushing Hammer, which we. Sadly fail, but we can attach this here, and then just swarming sting and take out this Manaphy. <laughs> yes, that this deck can just snipe, snipe to your heart's content. Okay, there's a Weedle. There's a Weedle. So if he does take out um this Beedrill, I mean if he does, he takes 60 damage. We can just revitalize it out. Um, and I would really like to get a Force of Giant Plants. That'd be nice. Well, he just Crystal Rays. Nothing too surprising. I might just snipe the Sardacuno. But ooh, this is going to be annoying to deal with. Because he could. How many VSC could I use? Only one. Okay. 
that's a bit more promising. I'm going to start here. And I'm just going to swarming sting the Articuno for 80. Which, um, isn't a lot. But it's something. Oh, yeah, he, he just played rough seas. That's annoying. We can still take this out. But he's going to start healing up his Glaceon. I'm fine that he's playing in, because I don't want to deck out, and I could use some new cards. Oh, that's not bad at all. So we have Crystal running us for 80. Okay, we do have a Via Seeker. What do I want to do, do with it? I might grab a Lysander, and then switch him out. Then attack the Glaceon, but or I could just take out this Articuno and see what's in my prize cards. How many Beedrills have we discarded? Okay, we have one line in the discard pile. We do have two Revitalizers left in our deck, so I think now I just need to focus on getting new cards. So I need to do here. That kind of helps, I guess. Do I really want to... How many stadiums has he used? Um, Rough Seas. And Silent Lab. I'm guessing he has one more left. Rough Seas. But I'm just going to hope he doesn't have it. We're going to throw down this here. And we're just going to Swarming Sting. Hit the Articuno for the knockout. And it is a Bursting Balloon. I just saw something. I think we really just messed up. Cause now, oh wow, we can't Lysander or anything now. Oh wow, oh my gosh, oh, oh man, well played. That was embarrassing to say the least. There's no really way we can take him out with bursting balloons, cause he's just gonna heal. Well, good match, good match. Let's just end for one card. See what we get. Hey, it's a Via Seeker. There's no really way I'm... Can we poison him? Okay, we can poison him. But that's not going to do much because he can heal. Oh, man. That really, really... Ah, I really, really messed up. Really, 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 really messed up there. But, um... We tried our best. We did try our best. So he's just gonna crystal ray us for 80. No really surprise. He, <laughs> we just put 70 damage on him, which is nice. Hey, Revitalizer. I'll take that. Let's grab another beat drill. I'm crying, we misplayed so bad. But there is really no way we can beat him. So I'm just going to be a seeker for a sycamore and just be like, here goes my deck. And we, we're just going to, we're going to go full out. Have a beedrill squad out. Or actually, we can't really because we can't evolve. But let's just swarming sting for, ooh. That was cool. Cool shield effect. I didn't know that happened. But, um, that's cool. So he just heals up. And I think he's going to end the game. I think he's going to end the game. Oh, he's sick of Morin. He's sick of Morin. Yes, he's sick of Morin. But he's going to take me out right now. And there's nothing I can do. Because I have zero cards in my deck. Go be drill. And we're just going to end it all. So, very well played. Very, um... 
I really like that water box, water tool box deck. Um, very, very neat. So that will about wrap up this video. Um, thank you so much for watching. This has been Swaggy Lucha 05, and I will see you in the next video.